Hey everybody, I just wanted to explain some free choice stations that I've got going on in the gym this afternoon with my kindergarten and first grade students. Basically we have a free choice Friday today that the kids have earned and uh, as a result we're going to be doing some stations in which they'll get to choose uh, what they'd like to do and how long they'd like to do it. So if they have one favorite station, they can play at that station the entire time as long as they're sharing equipment and taking turns with other people. Otherwise, if they've got a few things that they want to do, they've got to make sure that they use their time wisely and rotate whenever they uh, get tired so that they get a chance to do all the things they want. I'll walk you through real quick and show you what we've got going. Uh, basically, we've got some scooters set up here. We've got about four uh, in this area, and they're kind of just going to be playing with the scooter, sitting, kneeling, laying down on their stomach, spinning, you know, in this coned area here. So there's kind of some free choice, uh, some free exploration with the scooter, uh, as long as they're not standing and running into each other, we're doing okay. Uh, the next station I've got set up over here, I've got some hippity hops there on the bleachers. Kids can just grab one of those and they can be inside this coned area just kind of uh, bouncing and uh, playing with the hippity hops there. Got some large uh, large balls here that are used, that I use them for lots of different things, but this station just going to be a bouncing or a dribbling station. So with kindergarten and first, I'm just trying to get them to bounce the ball under control with repetitive bounces. So we've got a small area here inside the cones to play with those. Then we rotate down to this side of the gym. We move over here. I've got some uh, balls in this bucket. These are called feather lights. They're from sport time. They're kind of a cross between a balloon and a beach ball. They're a little uh, lighter than a, a beach ball, a little heavier than a balloon. They come in uh, purple and green. And you just fill them up with air. It's nice because they're... Uh, they are uh, inflatable, so you can deflate them when you're done. And they hold air pretty well. Um, so the kids can you know, do some striking uh, skills with them, try to hit them up in the air, try to keep them going. We'll also have another striking station here. I just set up a couple of these uh, standards here with the um, caution tape across the top. That's my quick uh, teacher trick for uh, making a net really fast. So I just used that ribbon there. I just bought a big roll of caution tape at the hardware store. So string it across there, and then um, that's my net. I just have the kids hit it over back and forth with this beach ball in the middle. So if they want to do some beach ball volleyball, they can just practice that, hitting it back and forth with kids on the other side of the net. Got some tumbling station over here where these mats are, so the kids can do cartwheels, forward roll, log roll, you know, some animal walks and things just down across the mat. And then there's also a balance beam, so they can work on their uh, balance beam going forwards or sideways or even trying backwards to walk backwards across the beam. So there's a couple options for the beam as well. Have a bowling station set up down here with a full lane bowling, right? So the kids have the, the ball here, and they'll take two shots, and they'll roll it down here at the pins, and then uh, after their two shots, they'll uh, set them back up, give the ball to the next person, go to another station, or if they want to play again, just get in line. And then finally, my last striking station here, we've got some rebounders. Uh, little koosh balls on top of these. Uh, they're just kind of a, a stretchy material, that, uh, like a little trampoline that the kids hold on to the blue handles there. And they just bounce the koosh ball up in the air to themselves. So those are my rebounders. So this afternoon, we've got a lot of stuff planned, a lot of, lot of activity taking place in the gym with kindergarten and first grade.